Big news from Delhi. The city is all set to try something new and exciting. Artificial rain through cloud seeding to help fight the growing air pollution problem. This will be the first ever trial of its kind in the capital. So what is cloud seeding? Cloud seeding, also known as artificial rain, is a method used to make it rain using signs. It's a weather modification technique where special particles are released into the clouds to help raindrops form and fall to the ground. These particles are called seed agents and they include silver iodide most common, potassium iodide, dry ice, table salt, liquid propane for very cold clouds. So how does it work? There are different ways to seed clouds by aircraft. Planes fly into or above clouds spray the seeding agents. Ground based generators. These release agents from the ground that rise up into clouds using rockets or artillery. Less common but also used in some places. Once the particles are inside the cloud, they help water droplets stick together, become heavier and fall as rain. Now why artificial rain in Delhi? Delhi has been battling serious air pollution, especially during winters. The idea behind artificial rain is simple, rain helps clean the air. It washes out harmful particles like PM2.5 and PM10, reduces gaseous pollutants like SO2 and NOx, helps settle dust and smog from the atmosphere. But remember, this is not a permanent solution. The clean air effect usually lasts only a few hours to a couple of days. It doesn't solve the root causes like traffic or industrial pollution. When is it happening? Delhi's cloud seeding is planned between July 4 and July 11, depending on the weather. The project is led by IIT Kanpur with flights approval from the Indian Meteorological Department and DGCA. There will be five aircraft flights, each lasting about 90 minutes, covering 100 square kilometers in the northwest and outer Delhi. The cost? Around 3.21 crore. Who else uses this tech? Countries like China have used cloud seeding for big events like clearing skies before the 2008 Beijing Olympics. India and UAE have also experimented with it to reduce pollution during winters. So will artificial rain help Delhi breathe easier at least for a while? We'll know soon. It's a bold scientific step and if it works, it might become part of India's pollution fighting toolkit. But long-term solutions still need to focus on cleaner transport, industry and waste management. What are your thoughts on this? Do let us know in the comments. Till then keep watching India TV for more updates.